with me and my best friends. Huh? Hey, Paula, check out my new race car. It can go super fast. Watch! That looks like fun, Tim. Can I try it? Um, okay, Billy. Can you help me make a racetrack first? Sure, Tim. What do we use to make the racetrack? Chalky's already helping to draw the racetrack. Good work, Chalky. Will this do, Tim? This is great. Thanks. Can I play with your race car now? Oh, I, um, need to make sure the track works first. I'll let you play after I'm done making the race car go three rounds. I promise. Okay, Tim. But how do I know when three rounds are up? Don't worry, Billy. A round is done when the car passes the finish line. And look, the numbers can help us keep track. Let's count the number of rounds the race car goes around the track. Ready, Tim? Get set, go! Look at it, go! Woohoo! One! Yay! Wow! Two! Two. Woohoo! Three! Four? Yeah! Five? But I thought it's my turn now. Come on, Tim. It's Billy's turn, and you promised him. Oh, <laughs> has it already been three rounds? Yeah, you went seven rounds. Oh, I'm sorry, Billy. I lost track. Hmm. Hey, it'll be much more fun if we had a bigger place to drive the race car, like a long stretch of beach at Treasure Island. You can play with the race car there, Billy. That does sound more fun. All right, let's race some cars at Treasure Island. This place looks perfect. Can I play with the race car now, Tim? Um, let's find a better spot. This area has too many rocks. The car might hit a rock and break. Okay, sure. How about this place, Tim? Hmm, I don't know. Hi, everyone. What are you guys doing? Hi, Maurice. We're looking for a good place to play with my new race car. Cool. Can I play too? Um, don't you have stuff to do for Redbeard? Oh, Captain Redbeard promised that I could have a day off. So here I am enjoying it. That's awesome, Maurice. Oh, yeah, and I have a great idea. Let's make a really cool racetrack for your race car. Cool. Yeah, let's do that. Wow, this racetrack looks awesome. I can't wait to try it out. Me too. This is the best day off ever. Can I play with the race car now, Tim? Sure, Billy. But, um, I think it's better if I test it on the new track first, just to make sure it works well for you guys. Oh, okay, Tim. Is it my turn yet, Tim? Yeah. Uh, can I have a go, too? Um, well... Come on, Tim. You promised, remember? Yeah, but I'm still testing the track. Aha! Look here. This part needs to be fixed. This coconut needs to be over here. It's almost in the same place, Tim. No, no, I really think this will make the track a lot better. But I would have to test it again to make sure. <sighs> Not again. Arr, what are you doing here, Maurice? Get back to work. I have an entire ship deck that needs cleaning. Uh, but you promised that I could have the day off. 
Yar, stop your whining. I just realized there's more work to be done. Come on now. Oh, man. Well, gotta follow the captain's orders. Oh, dear. Oh, man. That's not fair. Redbeard promised Maurice a day off. Yeah, Tim. That isn't fair. And by the way, you also promised Billy that he could play with your race car. Huh? This is how you keep your promise. Step one, remember what you promised. Step two, don't make excuses. Step three, do what you promised. That's it. This is how you keep your promise. Okay, Tim. Let's follow Paula's steps to keep your promise. Step one, remember what you promised. Well, I promised that I would let you play with my race car. But I was hoping to test the racetracks first to make sure it was okay for you. That's step two. Don't make excuses. I guess you're right. I was making excuses. Sorry, Billy. Now for step three. Do what you promised. Here, Billy. You can play with the race car now, but be careful with it. I promise. After I'm done, can the rest have a turn too? Yeah, I guess that would be okay. Hey guys, can I play next? Captain Redbeard went off treasure hunting, so I'm free again. Hi Maurice, sure, you can go next. We helped Tim keep his promise, Paula. That's right, Billy. Now when is it my turn to play with the car? <laughs> <laughs> Click subscribe and hit 